the opportunity, and I know it's a very busy time for Governor-elect uh, and Ms. Yunkin, but uh, they took the time to come over here and gave us the, the opportunity to, number one, congratulate them uh, on a successful campaign, uh, and also to welcome you uh, to, to your new home. And, uh, we uh, talked about a, a number of things, but uh, first of all, uh, just our, our pride uh, and, and the privilege of, of being able to be me the 73rd governor and, and Mr. Yunkin the 74th governor of the Commonwealth of Virginia. Uh, we talked about something that we share in common. Uh, we both have wonderful wives and first ladies. They're both from Texas, uh, interestingly, and so they have been able to to reminisce and, and talk about some of their past uh, in, in Texas. And, and probably one of the most important things that we talked about today is, um, you know, Mr. Yunkin and I uh, share uh, some, some something in common. We both enjoy playing basketball. Um, obviously, his career progressed a lot farther uh, than mine did, but uh, we have picked out the perfect place for a, a basketball goal uh, behind the mansion. So, uh, looking forward to coming over here and looking forward and, to it. And, and, and shooting some hoops with you. I, I wanted to just take this opportunity very briefly uh, to thank some people. Uh, number one, I want to thank you, the press. Uh, it has been our goal uh, during the last four years to provide accurate and up-to-date information to our fellow Virginians, and I have enjoyed uh, working with all of you and appreciate the work that you do. Secondly, uh, some individuals that don't get enough thanks and credit are not only our current First Lady, our future First Lady, but previous First Ladies have done so much wonderful work, uh, not only here at the Governor's Mansion, welcoming people here, uh, but also across the Commonwealth. And, and Pam, to her credit, has done so much work with early childhood education and being stewards of our environment, making sure we have clean air uh, and clean water. So Pam, thank you and to all our other First Ladies and future First Ladies. Uh, thank you for that. I also wanted to take uh, this opportunity to thank our EPU, our Executive Protection Unit. Uh, they are around you now. Uh, you don't see them, uh, most of them, but uh, they have done such a wonderful job keeping Pam uh, and me safe, as well as our, our family. Uh, they are members of the Virginia State Police, and there are no finer men and women, in my opinion. So to our EPU, I want to say thank you. I want to also thank our, our mansion staff, uh, from the chef to our mansion director to the people that, that really have spoiled Pam and me for the last four years and, and also have done such a good job welcoming all Virginians to this mansion, which is the, the people's house. So, so to our uh, mansion staff, I say thank you. And, and finally, the, the BMFA and, and other museums that, that have been such a part, a large part of, of the decorations that we had, the portraits telling the history of Virginia, which is so important, and, and welcoming all of us. So uh, I just speak on behalf of Pam and me. This has been a tremendous privilege. Uh, we look forward to uh, Mr. Yunkin and his wife uh, taking over and continuing a lot of the good progress that we've made. So uh, as far as welcoming you, Glenn and Suzanne, I, I have, a, and I'm sure you've seen these before, but I have some challenge coins. Um, and this is uh, my challenge coin uh, that has a picture of the mansion on the front and, and then the Virginia seal on the back. So I would like you to have this. Uh, and we're just welcoming you to your new home. Yeah. And Pam has something for you. Thank you, Pam. Thank you. Yes, and please welcome our Governor-elect to, to be the 74th Governor of the Commonwealth of Virginia, Mr. Glenn Young. Welcome, Governor. Glenn. Governor, thank yes, you sir. very much. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> well, uh, good afternoon, and thank you all for being here. And we just had a lovely lunch. I can't describe it any other way. Uh, and uh, to be welcomed with such grace uh, into this home is incredibly humbling uh, for Suzanne and me. Uh, you know, I'm a I'm a homegrown Virginian. And to have a moment to stand here in front of this historic building uh, and to stand here and think about all of the many, many important uh, decisions that have been made here and the many people who have passed through these doors, uh, it's a bit humbling for us to be here today. Uh, the, the, governor, the governor and first lady and Suzanne and I had an amazing lunch. Um, I think we should actually thank the kitchen team too. They were amazing, the chef and everyone who prepared it. Um, but it also gave us a chance to talk about our, our transition, and I just want to thank you for the 
for the incredibly cooperative way that you've, of course, expressed you're going to help us. It's important. We've, we've got a lot of work to do. Uh, day one's going to come fast. And on day one, we need to go to work. And so I just so appreciate your willingness to be so, so helpful as we head towards uh, this next stage in Virginia's future. Uh, and then finally, and I do so appreciate your welcoming of the, of the press team here, um, we're going to continue to be incredibly open and accessible. And I think one of the things that has excited me most during this campaign, but also as we head forward, is just the open interaction uh, that we have. And we're going to have a lot to talk about because we're going to be uh, moving forward with the real pace. Uh, but I appreciate everybody being here today. And uh, I, Suzanne and I look so forward uh, to serving all Virginians. And uh, we just appreciate the opportunity this, this afternoon to get started in this way. Uh, so thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank what you stood Thanks, out everybody. to you in your meeting, Governor-elect? What stood out to you in your meeting? Excuse me? What stood out to you in your meeting, sir? Uh, today, was, today was the beginning of a friendship, and uh, I appreciate that. And uh, I think that what's most important in a moment like this is to, is to actually have someone who you can call and, and ask questions. And so I just appreciated that entire sentiment today. Um, it's also really fun, as, as the, governor, the governor said, that we share uh, one very important moment, um, and that is we both married up in a big way. Uh, and, and the good thing is that we both acknowledge it and recognize it, and, uh, and that's going to be a, a great uh, way for us to develop a future friendship as well. So thank you all very, very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir.